Hello, first grade. So we are going to be drawing from direct observation. Now we've already learned that direct observation means when you are looking at what you are drawing. So I have picked up a dessert object here. I've got an ice cream cone, now it's just a magnet. If you are learning virtually, you can find any type of dessert item in your house that you would like to draw. Um, <clears throat> so we're going to draw by looking very carefully at what we're drawing. So we're going to follow the contours or the outlines of our drawing first, and then we're gonna come back in and add details. So <clears throat> when I do this, I'm gonna kind of use my finger to show you what I'm doing with my eyes. So where I'm gonna start is down here in the corner. And I'm gonna start to slowly move my way up to make the base of the stick there. Then I notice, oh, this bottom part comes out. And I'm gonna take it all the way up so I'm looking very, very carefully at the object I'm drawing. I'm not actually looking at my drawing very much at all. I'm more so looking at my ice cream. And I'm gonna follow with my finger. Okay, it's kind of bumpy. It goes down in a slant there. And then it's ready to go back down. I can follow my shape back down. And it's gonna curve back in. And then I notice that the stick is much skinnier than the ice cream cone. So now I've got my contour or my outline. Then I can come back in here and add some of the details. So it's got some chocolate sauce. Yum, yum, yum. Got some drizzle on it. Okay. Now I'm not gonna draw every single little flake on here because I would be here all day. I don't wanna do that, but I'm gonna kind of put some of those details in there. Do the lines in the wood if I want. Okay, so the key is we're going to have some repetition, like Wayne Tebow. He never just drew one thing. So we're gonna repeat this however many times it'll fit on our paper. The last thing I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna trace over my pencil lines with a Sharpie so that I can see my ice cream cones really well. Alright, now you're going to want to save these for next time. Next time we'll talk about adding color to these, but for today that's where we're going to stop.